having a ball at your feet at my age, not bad. I love a football. I mean, I still love football. It is my first choice for anything. The thing I enjoy most about walking football is the camaraderie of the guys, um, the banter, you know, just sort of being part of something. Uh, my friend there, Raz, I played football with him when I was at school, so I'm now playing football with him 50 years later. <laughs> and still nutmegging him, I'll tell you. Yeah. Yeah, you can see by the sweat, you know, <laughs> keeps you fit. I'm coming up to nearly 75 now, so uh, I used to do circuit training. But uh, when this came up, I, I started doing this, and uh, well, I'm, I'm still quite useful at it, you know. I think it does a lot for your physical fitness, but even more so your mental fitness, you know, because you're, you're with other guys who are experiencing similar sort of uh, things to you, and you can talk about them. I suppose when you retire, you miss your workmates and things like that, and then all of a sudden you've got a new gang of about 20 people, um, and I've rekindled a lot of old friendships, so it's really good. It, it brings players on a lot, and they'll come in and you can, you'll see the first session, and they'll be absolutely exhausted, and give it a few weeks, and they'll be looking for more, they'll want more and more. Everyone who plays says it's the something they really look forward to in the week, which, which I absolutely agree with, you know. And uh, you feel good, it's um, self-esteem, you know, if you score a goal, there's nothing like scoring a goal, it just feels fantastic. I look forward to every Tuesday morning, I think, hey, you know, get up, put the old kit on and off we go, so yeah, I like it, it's good, it's good fun. We go over to the local cafe over the road, you know, and have a coffee and a chat about things, you know, and uh, yeah, yeah, no, I'll just say it's sort of the highlight of the week.